Hi guys, today I'm gonna show you my Erin Condren warehouse order that it finally arrived. And let me see how I can open this huge box up. Oops, I'm moving everything. I'm sorry about that. It's, it's a huge box. Um, let me see if I can, I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to leave it this way and kind of show you things on camera because it's hard just zoom out and zoom back in so let me just get the stuff out so what i'm going to do actually i think it's going to be the best way to go is just get this box out of the way because it's huge and then just bring everything into a pile over here okay so let me just go ahead and do that oh gosh it's heavy too so let me just bring everything here into a pile so you guys can see what I got. And I don't know, hopefully everything came because I've been hearing that a lot of people have had issues and their orders have not been complete. So I'm really, really hoping that's not the case with me. And I, I don't have my my order sheet right here because they don't include a packing slip. So I'm not sure if I got the whole order or not. Okay, so let's start getting this kind of sorted out. Um, these Hello Kitty notebooks are, I, I mean, they're super cute. I'll open one up with you guys. I just wanna kind of see how many I got. So there's four over here, then five, and this is part of the binder. So let me just put this to the other side. Um, I'm sorry, there's four. Um, let me see what else I've got here, right? So let's just take care of these first. Okay, so there's eight in total, and I think that's accurate. I don't remember if I ended up doing 10 in total or not i can always look that up but let's just open one up and see what we got and you might be asking yourselves why i have so many of these well reason being that my daughter's next birthday is going to be hello kitty themed so i thought these would be cute cute party favors for the girls and I love the foiling. It's kind of like a rose gold foiling. And you know, it's just a notebook, but I think they're going to be so um, happy and excited to have it. I think it's such a cute thing to have. And look at that, so nice. And I'm assuming that the other one, the difference between this one and the other one is the foiling inside and the color of the foiling because this one is rose gold, like I showed you guys already. And this one, let's open it up and check it out. And if we do a celebration for my daughter this year, I'm not sure because with all that's going on and um, something starting to spike up again, I'm not sure what's gonna happen. Oh my gosh, I like the foiling in this one even better than the other one. Because the other one is just the, the bows, but this one has the, the Hello Kitty face. I really like it. It's super cute. You know, sadly, to just not be perfect, it's white, so I think it'll get dirtier easier. But I like this one better, much better. Super cute. Okay, so there we go. That's the Hello Kitty part of the order. Um, let's now go through the notebooks. These notebooks were very, very hot on the sale because I, I, I'm part of a whole bunch of groups and people were just going crazy over them getting a few of them and i thought i had gotten a couple of each 
I really have to check my order because I'm thinking I got more things than what I really ended up with. And I love the flora pattern and you know, it's just such a cute thing to have. Oh, these got in there somehow. And the back cover is super cute too. And you know, just front and back. And I don't think it's interchangeable. Oh, it is. Oh, look at that, it is. Okay, so um, if you have an A5 planner, you could even um, exchange the the covers. And I love, I don't know, let me see, let, get, let me get this closer. It says love, gratitude, grace, and friendship. I really think this is such a nice journal type of um, planner. I really like it. Really, really like it. Super cute. And this one falls in the air. So let's see what it has. Uh, well, um, yeah, I mean, I like it. I, I don't think I love this stripe as much, to be honest with you. I mean, for the price that it ended up being on the warehouse sale, I'll say, well, it's okay, but it's nothing that I'm, um, and again, interchangeable as well. I think all their covers are, right? Okay, there we go. So this is the other notebook. Uh, I like the Flora one better by far. And let's just go over the inserts that I got. First, let's do the binder. So I got a binder. And I know that if you guys follow my channel, you know that I might be doing some Franken planning. And I think the binder is a perfect place to just keep everything that I'm not using because I don't want to be calling and uncalling and calling back again. <clears throat> so once I uncoil, I need a place to put everything in. And this is going to be my place. Uh, it, goes, it goes this way. And this is actually going to be my place. So I'll have everything in here. And I have heard some people say that, you know, they have issues opening it and closing it back up. It's a little tight, but I, I can open it and close it without much of an issue. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to put it back how it came. Maybe it's because that's why, because I was not doing it properly maybe. Uh-huh, there it is, okay. I'm not gonna put it back in the bag. I think that's a little bit too noisy. So it comes with these two inserts, which, this one is Take Notes, Classic Lined Pages. And um, this one is also Take Note and it's Productivity Pages. I don't know if I will be using any of these. This is a seven by nine planner uh, binder for a seven, seven by nine sheets. I don't know if I'll be using any of these pages when I'm doing the Franken planning. Maybe I will because I like to have just one place where I jot down all my ideas. So I think, these pages are gonna go very well with that. And then I also got the planning pack that coordinates with it. And some of my planners have also this, um, this uh, pattern. So I think it's gonna go very well with it. I don't have my seven by nine planners around but just so that you guys can kind of get an idea. I like this because every time I'm gonna record, I have to start looking for my stuff. So if I just have a set in here, I know that I just need to bring this and that's it. So I think that's just gonna be work perfect for me. And it, it even fits the A5. I'm working with seven by nine, but you know, you can even carry it with your A5. So I, after I ordered it, I was like, ah, oh, maybe I should order another one just because I really like it. I think it's very functional and, you know, it's it's very sturdy. So this is a, a good purchase in my opinion. Uh, let's see what else I've got here. Oh, and the other thing the binder comes with is this little hole punch. You know, I don't think you can punch more than one page at a time with it. It doesn't say anything, but of course you can 
you know, just add any type of paste you want to the binder with this hole punch. So I think it's gonna be at least good to have one. Uh, I think it's gonna be okay to have one of those. So let's, let's do the bookmarks. The reason why I got a few of these is because I'm almost positive that I ordered two of each of these because I wanted to get some uh, Christmas gifts, but I do not see them. So I, I need to figure out what happened. But these are just, um, I thought that these would go very well with these and that this bookmark would go very well with this one. So for me, it was an idea of just gifting it along with with the, with the notebook. And I got this other one for me because I, I don't mind whatever pattern the planner, um, the bookmark is. I just like having certain areas of my uh, planner and everything bookmarked. So I thought that was great. Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys why I bought this. Before I Franken plan, I'm gonna give another idea a shot, which is I really like to have my weekly view along with my vertical, along with my daily dual, okay? But having two planners is not the best, and that is why I'm like, well, maybe I'll Franken plan. But before Franken planning, I kind of wanna have these two inserts in there so that I can put each of the weekly pages here with some washi and just have it at hand in the same planner. But I don't know how that's going to go, to be honest with you. So worst case scenario, it's a checklist, a dashboard, and, you know, it can always be a gift as well. So, or a giveaway, I don't know. So I'm going to try it. I'm going to, I'm going to kind of see how that goes. And that is also why I got this one because I also thought, well, maybe this is just too big and this one might do the trick better. But I do feel that I order some other things that I'm not getting here. So I'll, I'll have to go and check my order. And then I got a gratitude journal. And you guys know that I have a monthly planner that I was thinking into converting into a gratitude journal. But for some reason, I tried kind of the concept and it quite didn't work for me when I was starting to implement it. So that other monthly planner, I'm just going to save it. I'm using one for budgeting and the other one, I'm just going to save it because with stickers, I can always make it into another one. So I might just use that other one for next year's budgeting. I don't know. It's not going to go to waste that much. I, I promise you guys. So I thought, well, let's get this see what it has, right? It's the Petite Planner. It's a nice book to have. And I kind of wanted to see what it's, what it's set to journal with. So um, ways I connected today, what I love about this time of the year, lessons I learned today, what I focused on today, cute things I saw today. And then there's something open so that you can kind of, um, write your own thing and then it says way i loved myself today fun things i did people i'm grateful for new things i tried way i supported others and then again another blank space so the the thing is that they're not always the same so you can choose to just do one page each day or do more because i, I don't think you need to do them all but it seems like each color has something different. And then 30 days of reflection, looking forward. So yeah, and then it starts over again. So let's count and see. So it's three, six, right? And then times two, times three, times four, and times five. Okay, so I think it's meant for you to tackle just one of these a day. Well, yeah, I think um, you don't necessarily have to use these these ideas that they have here, though. 
So at least having a place to write gratitude, I think it's fine. But in all honesty, I think that a horizontal planner can do the same thing if you don't need these prompts because I don't think I'm gonna be using them. So I'll just create some stickers to just write what I'm grateful for and the date and, the, and kind of like my gratitude. So I guess I'll figure it out. And this part I do like because it says my favorite moments, ways that I've grown, things I learned, some observations, goals and intentions, things to improve on, looking forward to, and next 30 day focus. So I think this part here is kind of nice and then it starts all over again. And then at the end, you have a six month reflection because this comes with six months worth of gratitude um, prompts. I'm gonna call them that way. And then you have six months reflections for the next six months. So, you know, the idea would be for, for you to buy another one, but I think a horizontal will work great for this. And then you have some stickers. I do like the theme of the stickers because it's all positive phrases and encouragement. So I do like this theme and it goes very well with, with the planner. So that is a nice thing to have in this petite gratitude journal. And this is edition two. So if any of you were thinking about it, I, you know, I like it. I'm gonna give it a shot. So maybe you will see some of these videos in my channel, but to be honest with you right now, I'm maxed out with all the tasks that I need to do. So I don't think I'll start this anytime soon, but um, at some point I will. So just stay tuned. And that's it. Right now I'm gonna go back and check my order because I wanna make sure that I got everything here. And I'm just super extra happy to have gotten these because the main reason why I placed the order was for these and for the binder. Everything else was just kind of like an addition because at the time I purchased, if you bought four, you would get an extra 15%. So it was already 50 off, then an extra 15%, and then I had a 20% off. So it ended up being like a, a, a great buy. But these, these to me are just worth my whole order because of my daughter's birthday favor. So I think this is going to be a great thing to have. Okay, guys, again, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this haul and stay tuned because I did order the fall surprise box and I will be doing an unboxing of that one when I receive it because of course mine says it'll ship between August 25 and 28th or 27th. So I will be getting it very late August, if not first week of September. So stay tuned. My next video should be my uh, daily planning. And I'll let you know in my next video if I did get everything I ordered or not. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Bye.